Hi everyone, this is Akasha from Divine Inner Magic. I welcome you for a weekly oracle channeling from the 24th of June to the 30th of June. Um, today is the 29th, so uh, whoops. And um, if you want to join me at 5 p.m. IST on my on my radio show, Blog Talk Radio, you can come on. If you want to phone in, get a channeling, do so. It'll be good fun. And uh, you can check out my website at www.divineinnermagic.com. And so we're just going to start, go straight into it, see what the guides have to say to bring forward for this week and especially for this day. And uh, just see what comes up. So just take a deep breath. A sip of water. Dear Goddess God, a hundred thousand angels, the Arcturians, Pleiadians, Pegasus and Orion, the Arcturians, come to us now, come and protect us, a hundred thousand of you around each one of us, a hundred thousand protective warrior angels, as well as Archangel Michael, Raphael, Uriel and Gabriel, Mother Mary, Mary Magdalene, the Elohim, the Council of Twelve. All the beings that wish to assist us, all the fairies from this planet and others, and the goddesses, come, come, come and encircle us now. Thank you. And each and every one of us calling upon our personal guides to come and assist us, allowing us to go into this beautiful light state and anything that is that we may be carrying to be completely and fully released, and angels take it to the light now, never to return. Thank you. Any cords that need to be cut, be cut. Roots removed, take them, angels to the light, never to return, and brush away any negativity or any false beliefs that we may be carrying at this hour. Take it away now, take it, take it, take it, to the light, never to return in any time, space, or dimension. Thank you. We are fully protected, and I ask to be a pure neutral channel, and I ask for the highest, most loving, most appropriate guide to come and talk through me now. Thank you. Dearest ones, indeed this is I, Isis. I come to you all today with a new frequency of light that is being carried down with the divine lavender angels and fairies that come and wish to assist you. Indeed it is time of opening your third eye and allowing it to be fully activated in order for you to know that you can regain your natural right, your birthright of your spiritual and intuitive nature. Indeed, this divine feminine energy that is talked about is one of your intuition and your ability to be connected to all realms at all times. It is important that you know how to cleanse yourself and protect yourself. If you do not know this, ask someone who does and ask quickly for this is crucial at this time. Once all beings on this planet are able to cleanse and heal themselves and protect there will be major change. At this time we see that many of you do this but not yet enough. So we wish for you to regain the responsibility of yourself and for your family so that you can cleanse out your households as well as your energy fields so that you are not carrying around any entities or anything, any cords or any energy that is not serving your highest good. Please do this as soon as possible. And we are pressing upon Akasha at this time to create videos so that you can refer to them. So at this time we are just allowing yourself to be fully and completely cleansed. The angels are working on you right now and we are now bringing down these beautiful spectacles, these beautiful specks of light. I'm laughing because of my glasses. Okay, <laughs> spectacles. So this is a cash. So I'll just go back in. My brother says when I burst out laughing, it looks like I'm taking the piss. I'm really not, but <laughs> it just makes me laugh. Okay, so just going back in.
<laughs> okay. <laughs> As we bring down this frequency, dearest ones, this is I, Isa speaking, that we bring through this energy. <laughs> and Akasha cannot handle it, for she is of a giggly nature, and so she is finding it difficult to maintain the two energies, one of me speaking through her, and one of her holding this frequency. Enjoy it as it comes, for there is no judgment here. There is no sense of having to be serious in order to be spiritual, for laughter is the greatest joy that you will experience on this earth plane. So we encourage you to laugh, and this is a reminder. At this time, breathing into your energy field and into your aura, allowing just this energy at the top of your crown, you may feel a sense of itchiness or opening, and just allow yourself to fully breathe in these specks of light. They are lavender and golden and white color now. And they come and they place themselves on any area of your energy field that needs assistance. Any on your physical body, an emotional body, spiritual body, and mind. And they are coming down now. And as they touch your body, there is like an illumination that's happening, a sense of a matrix forming and you seeing through your vessels and skin and you seeing this energy as like the matrix that is creating all around you. Feel this energy descend now and feel yourself fully and completely connected. Breathe it in, there's three stands of, strands of white lavender and golden and see it mesh within your cells in your muscles in your bloodstream and your bones and allow it to bring forward this new dna strand that is connecting to your higher being it is connecting to your third eye and to the back of your neck and connected to the occipital bone that place right in the crook of your neck is connecting now and to the top of your head it is finally complete and this energy is floating down through your energy field now and cleansing out you may feel it leave through your feet and through your fingers and through your base chakra allow your base chakra to open fully and completely now and send this light down into the center of the earth Remember that you are a messenger and a carrier of this light now, and as you walk forward with ease and grace, you will be able to pass it through with your bare feet and your base chakra into the centre of the earth. It will bring great knowledge and great truth, and all will be well. Under the earth there are many beings that are not welcome here, that are living when we say welcome here, it is that they are not playing out the rules and the laws of the universe. Like humans also, but it is a choice. You have a choice between the light and the dark, and we are thankful that you listening have chosen the light. Thank you, thank you. And so allowing your feet and this energy to come through you, call upon myself, Isis, and the Lavender Fairies, and we will bring this frequency down into the earth. This is crucially important at this time, and you will see that there will be great change around you. Practice with it, play with it, and know that it is important for you to be joyful and laughing. We love you and bless you and send you the greatest love always, and so it is. We are complete. We love you. We love you. We love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> Wow, okay, I don't know how that was for you. I found that really hard not to burst out laughing the whole way through. Um, I did have this uh, download very similar from Isis and the Lavender Fairies during my class on Thursday, on my teleconference class, so you can check out my website for the next one. is on the 17th. I think I haven't changed it yet, but it's on the 17th of July. Um, I highly recommend the classes. They're really good fun. They're my favourite thing to do. And... Um, 
yeah, just um, this energy, just allow it to really come through your base chakra, pull it down when you feel that you're, you're unsure about something or you're doubtful, you're worried or any any emotion that doesn't feel pleasant and you you want some assistance, call upon Isis and the Lavender Fairies and allow this energy to just float down through your whole being, down through and out through your feet into the centre of the ground, in the centre of the earth and this will really help. So I hope you liked this video, if you have you can press like on the bottom, if you um, dislike it then just stop watching and um, if you are following it just let me know so I can put them up on time. I'm going to try and do that anyway but it's always nice to know that people actually <laughs> listen to them. Um, so yeah, lots of love to you all, have a great week and I'll try and see you on Monday or so in two days for the next video. Lots of love. Bye. Thank you.